Olivia, I love you because you are the most beautiful woman in the world, obviously. That is why I chose you. And you're so sweet. You encourage me to be better. And that is the most important part. I like that uh, I will strive to be the best I can for you. So that, in general, is uh, the most important thing. You encourage me to be a, a better husband, a, a better person in general, uh, to be a Christ-centered man. And uh, I just love you because your personality is just awesome. You make me laugh. You make me comfortable. And that is why I love you so much. Dan, I love you because ever since I met you, I felt that connection I've never had with anyone else. And every moment we spend with each other, I fall more and more in love with you. I'm excited about today and that we're getting married. And I'm looking forward to the rest of our life, lives together, spending that uh, those days, those moments, uh, together and just making memories and Dan in 50 years I see us being grandparents to 10 and more kids um, having grandkids um, living at the beach doing ministry there for the homeless that don't uh, kids that don't have a shelter um, just moving forward in ministry traveling a lot, taking our kids with us, um, being one big happy family. I want them to look as good as you. And um, that's it. So 50 years from now, I see myself with you, growing old, looking good, <laughs> uh, in a conservative house, I think don't want to go anything anywhere big and just focusing on Christ and living for Him, serving in the ministry in any way uh, possible. Uh, may we be encouraged by Him and that's the most important thing. Hopefully with uh, no more than four kids or, or less, than, less than two. Uh, and just being conservative and loving Christ, that's the most important, most important part. I just want to say that I love you. I love you.